Well, new tonight here at 10, we all treat our pets like they're part of our family, of course, but going to the vet can be quite the chore, especially for a sick dog or cat or one who just doesn't like to go. Now there's a new effort, though, underway to create a telehealth program just for pets and their vets. Fox 13's Genevieve Curtis explains. Getting your pet to the vet could soon be as simple as a click of a mouse. The Florida legislature cleared the way for virtual visits. And it's important because roughly one third of pet owners don't see a veterinarian at the moment. Uh, and our hope is that uh, for those people who are either at socio socioeconomic disadvantage, they cannot get to a veterinarian, either they can't take the time off of work or they don't have a vehicle to, to transport their animal, uh, or they live in an area that is a veterinary desert. That's There's many of those across the country. There's many of those across Florida. The bill aims to fill a veterinarian shortage and could help with costs. At the Humane Society of Tampa Bay, Sherry Silk says vet care is the second biggest reason pets end up in the shelter looking for new homes. It is really, really awful. It's awful across the country. It's particularly bad, it seems like, in Florida. Um, I am shocked by the reasons. We always ask people when they're turning their pets in, why are you giving up your pet? And the number one reason, well, the number one reason is moving. The number two reason is um, they can't afford vet care. She thinks virtual visits could help pet owners, particularly older owners, from having to give up their fur babies. It's terrible. Nobody wants to turn in, a, it's like turning in a family member, right? So no, this is a great move forward for the Florida, for state of Florida. The Florida Veterinary Medical Association says it's supportive of the proper use of telemedicine and establishes guidance for when it's appropriate. The ASPCA says if signed into law, Florida would be among one of the first states in the country to roll this out. And so this just gives veterinarians the opportunity to make the decision for themselves uh, when telemedicine makes the most sense for them. In Tampa, Genevieve Curtis, Fox 13 News.